So first, you just go to the search engine and you type finite one here. Finite one. Okay. So finite one is the flat platform, most biggest platform in Taiwan for renting a house or buying a house. So I think it's a saver if you go there to find your apartment. Right, and we click the first one, and yeah, so we will be in this page. And basically, because in this video, I'm mainly talking about renting, so please choose this one. Zu Wu. Zu means to rent, and Wu means the house. So Zu Wu, just rent the house. Oh yeah, so by the way, all the related keywords are in the description box. Please go there and download the free PDF, okay? Great, so this part, we're going to choose um, whichever city you are looking for. So it's divided into four parts. So the first part is North Park, Beibu. And Beibu we have Taipei Shi, Taipei City, Xinbei Shi, New Taipei City, Taoyuan Shi, Taoyuan City, Xinzhu Shi, Xinzhu City, Xinzhu Xian, Xinzhu County, Yilan Xian, Yilan County, Jilong Shi, Jilong City. And then Zhongbu, Zhongbu means the um, middle part, so Taizhong Shi, Taizhong, and Zhanghua Xian, Zhanghua County, Yunlin Xian, Yunlin County. Miao Li Xian, Miao Li County, Nan Tong Xian, Nan Tong County. Nanbu is the south part, so Kaohsiung Shi is Kaohsiung City. Tainan Shi is Tainan City. Jiayi Shi is Jiayi City. Jiayi Xian, Jiayi County, Ping Dong Xian, Ping Dong County. Dongbu is the east part, so Taidong Xian, Taidong County. Hualien Xian, Hualien County. Penghu Xian, Penghu County. Jingmen Xian, Jingmen County, and Lianjiang Xian, Lianjiang County. Right, so I'm just going to choose the Xinzhu Xian, for example. Uh -huh. And then you just click search. Okay, so here. Okay, so next one we will be in this page. Right, so I'm going to amplify a little bit more. Like this, okay? So I'm just going to walk you through the most important options. So this one, 位置, 位置, we just make sure again we are in the right place and we are in Xinzhu County, that's right. And here it's you can choose the township. So if you know which township or area you're going to stay, you can choose. If not, you can just ignore it, okay? So I'm going to choose Shi for me. Okay, and these are not very important, so I'm not gonna explain that. Okay, 类型, 类型 is the type. So by what I mean the type is like maybe you want a suite or other things. So first one, 不限, 不限 is if you don't care, anything's good for you, you can click 不限. But next one is 整层住家, 整层住家 means the whole floor. So if you are a family, maybe you will need this 整层住家. If you are one person, maybe you will choose 独立套房. 独立套房 means independent suite, which means that you will have your own bathroom and own living area and maybe sometimes a small area for a kitchen. 分租套房. Right, 分租套房 is also the suite. But it's usually like the whole building is owned by the same person and this person just divides each room in uh, divide each floor and each room to different person. Um so in this Fen Zhu Tao Fang you will be sharing your water bill or management fee to with other people. But in meanwhile this one you will pay by your own. Ya Fang. Yafang is also an independent room, but you won't have your own bathroom. You need to share with people. Living room and kitchen, you will need to share with other people. And Chewen is some, um, some people just want to rent for the car park, but that's not what we're going to look now. Okay, so Zhu Jing is the rent. Mm, important. Zhu Jing. So if you don't care, you can choose 
不限。也<笑>、yeah, obviously， 嗯、um, ，I think I care <笑>。So yeah， I'm gonna choose maybe this one。Mm, I don't think you will choose this one. It's going to be hard to find. Five thousand yuan 以下以下 means below, so below five thousand. It's quite difficult though. So I'm going to choose this one. And 格局格局 is the layout. So it's basically just telling you how many rooms. 不限 no limit. 一房 one room. 二房 two rooms. 三房 three rooms blah blah blah. Right, 平数 Yeah, here I have to explain to you that in Taiwan,、um, we have our own unit of counting the、um, space of a room. So this unit is 平 and one 平 is equals to three point three zero five square meter, right? So this one, if I choose 十平以下 below 十平 that means that the ten will need to times three point three zero five and equals to the square meter. So basically, you will need to calculate it to have an idea how big is that. And I think I'm just going to choose this one. 更多条件 more options. So, I think here is quite important. 房屋形态 is the house type. So, 公寓公寓 first one means apartment. But this type of apartment is like、um, doesn't have elevator. So usually, 公寓 is an older building. Yeah, and if you need, you want the newer one, you probably choose this one. 电梯大楼电梯 literally means elevator. And 大楼 is the building, so new building usually have the elevator. So I think I'm going to choose this one. And the 透天厝透天厝 is the whole building. Uh, maybe five floor. All the five floor are yours. 别墅 villa. Okay. 楼层楼层 means the floor. So if you have preference like me, like to stay in high floor, maybe you choose this one. Mm, it just depends on you, right? And 性别 is gender, so some people care about. Um,、uh, I mean, maybe just in Taiwan. I heard about a lot of my students saying it's very weird that the landlord care about which gender stay in their house in their place. But anyway, and it's just how it works here. Some people does care. So okay, so for people who. Like to rent the house? Maybe if you care,、um, you don't want any man lives lives like near you. <laughs> you will just choose this 女女 means female, 男 means male, all male, 男女皆可 both okay. So I think I'm not. I'm just going to ignore this option. 提供设备提供设备 means provided facility. Hmm, it's quite important. So I'm gonna go walk you through here those option. Yo, this yo you you see this yo are all means half. So yo, 电视 has TV. Well, I don't really care. 有冷气 yeah, I do care. 冷气 means aircon. 有冰箱 has fridge. Yes, I need it. 有热水器热水器 means water heater. Of course. And 有天然瓦斯 is the natural gas.、Mm, don't really care. 有第四台 cable TV. I don't really care. 有网路 Hmm, I need it. 网路 means internet. 有洗衣机洗衣机 washing machine. Hmm,、mm, yes. Oh wait. Okay. And 床 is bed. 床，呃、uh, ，if you don't want to buy your own、um, furniture, you can choose this one. 衣柜 closet, don't really care. 沙发 sofa, don't really care. Okay, that's it.、Um, other option, 其他条件 If you you have a car and you need a car park, you can choose 有车位车位 means car park. 有电梯 elevator, 
，有阳台。阳台 means balcony， 可开火。嗯 ，this is quite important. You can cook in your place. Because some of the landlord, if they just own that one room, and they wouldn't really like people to cook inside, because sometimes it's quite dangerous, right? So if you like to cook, definitely choose this one. 可养宠物、嗯。If you have any pets with you, pets, and you will need to click this one, because that means that you are allowed to have your pet in your apartment. 近捷运 close to metro. 可短期租赁，可短期租赁 means that you can rent it for just a short term, maybe you know, two months or three months. Right. So I want to, yeah, I already choose all those things, and after choosing those things, the all the all the available options are showing below. You can just choose one, and、uh, let's have a look. Maybe. I would like to have this one. 平数平数 means the space, and we just said that one ping is 3.305 square meter. So here's eight ping. You can just times it, and、uh, you will have an idea how big is that. 楼层 floor, and total we have 15 floor. We are at six floor. And 形态形态 is the type. So 电梯大楼 Which is the one I choose? The the building with the elevator, right? And、um, yeah, those are not not very important. Okay, so but here I do think it's quite important. So, uh, look at here the contact area. Um, 中介 means the、uh, agent. So that means 收取服务费 means that they will charge the service. Service fee, okay. So basically, in Taiwan,、um, if you you look、uh, your apartment through an agent, and usually they will have they will charge you half month of your rent as the service charge, okay. So you can contact this person through this number, right? And here are all the pictures. Uh, yeah, it's um. Hmm, it's quite nice for a person, I think. Good. So looking here, looking at here, ah,、uh, 押金 yes, very important. Right. So let's look at 押金押金 It's very important. That means the deposit. So, 二个月二个月 two months. So basically, in Taiwan, the deposit it's usually two months. Two months. Okay. Two months of your rent. So let's say this one is twenty, a、uh, one, ten thousand, ten thousand. So for your deposit will be a、uh, twenty thousand. Okay. So the first time when you are signing contract with your landlord or agent, you will need to prepare、uh, the first month rent ten thousand plus two twenty thousand two months, um, um two months of deposit. Okay. Okay, and the 管理费管理费 is quite important. 管理费 means the management fee, and here if it's like this, it's the it means that you don't have to pay, or maybe it's already included in the rent. 开火 can cook. 可以 okay 可以身份要求 identity. So 学生 student 上班族 Office person, office worker, 家庭 family, blah blah blah, not important. 车位，呃、uh, ，car park. No, 五 This character means nothing. 五最短租期 The minimum renting period is one year. 一年，一年 Usually it's 一年 Okay. 养宠物 To have pet. 可以，可以 means okay. And yeah, and here maybe we can look at here. 房东提供，房东 means landlord, landlord and provide 提供。桌子，桌子 it's the table. 椅子 ，chair. 衣柜 ，closet. 床 ，bed. 沙发 
sofa. 热水器 water heater. 天然瓦斯 natural gas. 电视 TV. 冰箱 fridge. 冷气 aircon. 洗衣机 washing machine. 网路 internet. 第四台 cable TV. Right, and those are just some description to attract you, attract people to rent it. And here are the、um, Google Map. You can see where you are, where is the place, and facility around here. And finally, so just. And finally, if you have any question, you can just leave your question here and just click send. But I suggest that you just contact through this number. Okay, right. So that's about it. And I hope this video helped you. And、uh, remember, if you need, you can just download the free PDF of with all the related keywords on the description box. Right, so that it's about it.、Um, I hope this video really helped you, and please share this video to whoever is also looking for apartment in Taiwan. And any question, you can just leave your question down below in the comment section. I will try my best to help you. And remember, you can download the free PDF in the description box as well. Right, so I will see you next time. Bye bye.